without leave us bro Just trust me. What's up, big boys, and welcome to our main unit, the German Messi and the Shaman. In this episode, boys, we're going to be looking at one of the bright up-and-coming young talents in the Air Divisie, Ajax's own Amin Yunus, who came from Borussia Mönchengladbach, uh, was really, really solid there, went over to Ajax. Last season, his first season with Ajax, had eight goals and five freaking assists. Almost makes me wonder if this is actually his freaking car. Pretty much in every interview, they try to sneak in a question about him and the comparisons to Messi. Trainer had said, we have no Messi. But that's true. Was that a little bit of Messi? He's, uh, he's got a low center of gravity, he's 5'6", he's short like Messi, and he has the agility and balance. I'm not just talking about in FIFA, but his play style and the way that he moves on the pitch is reminiscent of a Messi in his movement. Now, in FIFA, he has 99 agility and 99 freaking acceleration. Has one of the craziest ab ratings on his inform card. His 74 overall inform card. I believe he had a 68 uh, overall silver card to ship. Then he got a winner upgrade all the way up to 74, which is crazy. And then his inform card is also a 74. One of the rarest cards on FIFA. There's only one more on the Xbox One market right now uh, that I could find. Got him for 20,000 coins. Looks like an absolute freaking beast. The only thing missing, and I think a lot of people are going to agree if you're an Ajax fan, if you watch the RDBZ, he needs to have four-star skill moves. He definitely, definitely deserves four-star skill moves in FIFA 17. Now, like I said, he had eight goals, five assists, which would lead me to believe that he's possibly going to get himself an upgrade. His 74 overall winner upgrade, I would think maybe EA sneak him in and give him a 75, maybe 76 overall gold card just because he was a key component for that Ajax squad last year. My graphic designer is actually from the Netherlands, and uh, he actually played today, which is hilarious. Uh, Unius played today and apparently had a really, really poor game, according to my graphic designer, Luke. You guys might remember from last year, we did Lebanese Legend episode which was also a minionist given that his family is from Lebanon uh, he goes back there quite often was eligible to play for their national team but decided to go with Germany because that is actually where he was raised so you can't hate on him for that but uh, yeah his roots are in Lebanon one of my favorite countries in the freaking world also really quickly want to shout out the German Olympic team they play Brazil for the gold and silver placement in the Olympics in about 45 minutes so hopefully I can get done with this recording by then but uh, yeah, right now, we're looking at freaking Amin Yunus, one of my favorite players in Ultimate Team. We've got Arkadius Milik. We've got this guy, Al Ghazi, who is a freaking beast by the looks of it. Four-star weak foot, four-star skill moves. Not exactly sure how he is in real life. If you guys are AirDBZ or Ajax supporters, let me know how these guys play in real life. We've got Klassen, we've got Goodell, and we've got Bazur. A lot of people like this guy. I'm probably butchering these names right now. No real defensive midfielder in Ultimate Team. The highest rated uh, defensive uh, player that has a defensive rating is 71 Klassen. And then Goodell have uh, 71 defensive ratings. We've got Dix. I'm pretty sure that's pronounced Dykes. We've got Veltman, we've got Vesterman, the uh, Bundesliga hero goes to Ajax, legend goes to Ajax, and then we've got Van Rijn, uh, Van Rijn and then we've got Jesper Selesen uh, in at keeper, and then a bench full of some of the more uh, notable uh, notable player Ziyech, absolutely freaking amazing player, and then obviously we're gonna have Guardado in there as well. But this is the squad, boys. If you guys do enjoy the episode, hit that like button. Let's try and blast 77 likes, which I think is what Amin Yunus's FIFA 17 card should be as well. If you want to interact with me on Instagram and Twitter, those links can be found in the description below. Alan Pardew in the Netherlands having a freaking pastry. Let's get to a couple matches. Let's see how the freaking German Messi performs. All right, boys, here we go. Coming up against a BPL La Liga hybrid. Crazy, crazy news in the Premier League as well. Tried to watch most of the games, but was only able to catch Arsenal Leicester. Uh, Bellerin played well. Uh, Koscielny played okay, but that was a crazy, crazy game. Couple controversial uh, no calls on the pens. You know, Arsenal fans and Leicester fans probably aren't really happy with that. Both have, uh, I believe, two points. Wait, did Leicester? No, they both have. I think they both have won. Leicester lost their opening match. Arsenal lost versus Liverpool. I think they both have won. Probably not happy. Again, the oh, the most positive thing right now, it's early in the season, only two matches in. Uh, plenty of plenty of time to rebound. But let's get in this match. Let's see if Amin Yunus, the freaking German Messi, can live up to the freaking hype. Vesterman. Keeper Vesterman, bro, just like Kipe, uh, PK did yesterday. Kipe. Wait, actually, Kipe is a sick name for Keeper PK. The only thing he doesn't really have that's great is a lot of pace but that 99 acceleration like he might only have 79 pace which is not crippling but it gets to that top speed really really quickly because of that 99 pace holy arcadios milik has gone to napoli can he rip it from here shit 
I expert on Traori is like 100% extinct. There it is. The fish dive. Algazi! The four star skiller! Patricia! <sighs> Shitting bitch horse! My defense just freaking collapsed! Let's go! I mean, you just. The German Messi! Come on, boys! Go hug it out with this bro over here! He doesn't know what he's doing! Alright, boys, at halftime, we haven't convinced anyone that we're about to do any damage. 50% shot accuracy, 82% pass accuracy, at least we have that. Boys, come on, let's go, let's win this thing. 3-2! Holy shit, he just jumped like 10 feet in the freaking air, boys! What a goal, 79th minute! Freaking Arkady Urspielik! What a freaking twirl, dude! And then he kicks that guy in the freaking nuts! We're going to freaking extra time! Nine shots for on target, we stepped it up big time in the second half, we didn't get ourselves that 3-2 victory yet. Let's get in the second half, let's get into extra time, let's freaking win this! No? No pen? Wow, dude, Jasper Celestin has saved us this freaking match. Are we really going to pens? Are we really going to- f Jasper Celestin, you freaking ledge! Right at the middle. Blast that! Come on! He's going middle this time. Yo! I pressed up to go middle, and he ended up going right. Eunice, start the epi. Let's go! He missed two, I made two, let's do this! Going left to fail. We got this, boys. Unless we, like, fluff it. Okay, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. Going right. He's going right. Oh, my God. I chose the right side. Come on, I make this. It's it. Right up the middle. Yes! We freaking win it, boys! Dude, come on. Go celebrate. Go run your teammates, dude. All right, Amin Yunus, 7.3. No assists, Algazi had an assist, Milik had a goal, and Yunus had a goal. Uh, 7.3 rating, not too bad, expected a little bit more, 10 shots, 5 on target, picked it up. Uh, big time in the second half and an extra time. Let's get in the second game, let's freaking tear this one up. And not go to freaking pens, we're going to pens like every other episode. Alright boys, here we go, coming up against a league end freaking dream team. He's got Lucas, he's got Pastore, he's got Ben Alpha, Matuidi, David Luiz, and the possible Arsenal man Lacazette up front. Wait, is that <laughs> Ref, hand out some yellow. Hand out some yellow. That's what I'm talking about, boys. He ripped it right out of his chest. Dude, he has no long shots. Five, four, three, two, one. Yes! Do this! That's what he does! He scores inside the box. He can wiggle around like crazy. He might not have four-star skillers, but he's got LTRT, and that's all he needs. Dude, that's what he does. He just wiggles by players. He doesn't have any long shots, though. He does have four-star weak foot, which is something he has going for him. Five shots for a target, 56% possession, boys. Arkady Oh, it's over. Referee. Oh, it's over. There we go. Come on, boys. Who are we giving this to? Oh, we didn't wait. Hold on. What the hell did I just do? I mean, that came really close, but I didn't click A to give it to Milik. That's it. I made a mistake. Oh my god. Is he bringing the big guns? Who's he bringing in? Oh no. Is that it? That's in! Woo! Costa. Look at this Costa. Oh my god, come on! Oh, oh, I immediately fuck up. Oh my god. I immediately fuck up. 
Oh god! Oh god, he pet? No. Boys, we have one half of extra time to freaking do this. Oh my god. <laughs> You knew what me and Eunice was gonna do that the entire time! Wow! Literally seconds left to do that! I literally feel like throwing up right now. Holy freaking gamokes! I mean, Eunice bails us out in the last minute from going to the second consecutive freaking pens. I mean, Eunice, two goals, possibly no bigger one than the second one he scored. 12 shot, six on target, very, very even match. I mean, Eunice comes up huge late in the game. But anyway, boys, there you have it. The freaking German Messi, Amin Yunus. Wouldn't say it's the greatest card by any means. 8.3 rating in the second match. Uh, had goals in both matches against pretty, pretty solid teams. This guy gave me a very, very tough match, and I can't believe it actually ended the way it did. But anyway, boys, hopefully he gets himself an upgrade. Hopefully, I'd love to see a 75 or 76 overall gold card in FIFA 17. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think his card rating should be. Um, and I guess kind of ignore the fact that apparently he had a bad match tonight. Um, again, my graphic designer, Luke, um, who's the best graphic designer in the community, uh, watch, I think he watched the game today and said that it wasn't really the best performance. But anyway... The young freaking German Messi puts in a good performance for us. That's all that matters. If you guys did enjoy the episode, hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, tschüss, later, ade. Wait, Pards, is it like this? <laughs> Not quite, my dear boy. It's more like this. Oh, no!